Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to VFG Movie Reviews with your host, Tim Williams. How's it going, guys? Welcome to VFG Movie Reviews, and this is my review for Disney Strange Worlds. Um, so, honestly, I don't know how I feel about this movie. One thing... I do want to say is people need to stop fixating that Disney wants to turn their kids gay. And this is why Disney keeps putting these gay characters in movies. It needs to stop. It's it's life, guys. It's life. Why wouldn't you think that these characters wouldn't be in these types of movies? It's life. More than not, you have somebody who is LGBTQAI+. I think I said that right. Like, you, you you know these people. They interact. So why couldn't they be in a movie? It's just life. Get the fuck over it. Get the fuck over it. That's all I'm going to say on that six. That's all I'm going to say on this is get the fuck over it. Now, I, I dug this movie. I dug the look of it. It reminds me of the old pulp sci-fi comics from back in the day. That uh, I didn't grow up with those. I, I got into them when I was starting to collect comic books and shit like that. But this is, was that feel. And I, I really I really dug it. And yes, it was a commentary on that we're killing our planet. And and we are. Like, it's, it, it, it's just fact at this point. We are destroying the planet that we are on. And we're eventually all going to be fucked. I mean that's just how it that this is just how it's gonna play out. So it's fine for movies to tackle those things in their own world, and that's what I, I that's what I dug about this movie. We had some great voice work with Jake Gyllenhaal, uh, Dennis Quaid, Kieran Slull, Lucy Liu, Gabrielle Union, uh, Alan Tudyk. Like we had some great great voice acting in this movie. I just I. I love the premise and the concept of the movie, but it seems like Disney's done this type of movie before. Not the concept, just the core story. You know, the dad's obsessed with X, Y, and Z. He leaves his family. The family grows up. The kid has a chip on his shoulder. He doesn't want to be that type of dad to his kid. And like X, Y, and Z. Like, I think they need to get out of that box. I don't think this is a bad movie. I think this movie is going to do really good on streaming. I don't... Yes, it didn't do that good in theaters. But I also don't think Disney put any money behind marketing. I think this was just kind of always supposed to go to streaming. But they had to release it theatrically. Because probably the actors are like, we have theatrical releases. Like, streaming should, you know. Which I get. And which I... I, I I understand it's show business. It's about it's a business. It's not, you know, we're not friends here. It's a business. But I I, I dug this movie. I dug the look. I uh, splat the cute little character. I dug it. it. It was amazing. Everything really stood out for this movie. I just think the story has been done before. That's it. That's the only thing I say. I just think the story has been. Where does this lie? On our five star review, guys, this is a three star movie. I really wanted to give it more, but it's just a, a little bit. It's just a little bit above a, a, just an average movie. I hope it finds some love because I think there's love that should be there for this movie and for these characters. But uh, we'll see how it goes when it debuts. Thank you guys so very much for watching this video, and guys, please. Please, please, please. I'm going to say this in every video to the end of this year. We are 53 subscribers away from 1,000. My goal is to get to 1,000. It's all downhill from 1,000. I just want to get to 1,000. If you guys dig my content, if you guys dig my content, please give us a subscribe, give us a like, give us a comment, share the video, tell your friend, push that algorithm. I love it, guys. Thank you so very much, and we'll see you in our next review.